All right, World of Wonder. Today we are talking about something new and it's in the golf ball space. So as you know, Callaway Golf is at the, I'm gonna say they are the leader in alignment technology. We've been doing this for a long time. It's something that Callaway Golf takes very, very seriously. Alignment is a foundation to good golf. So as you know, we had the Chrome Soft family with Triple Track. Now across the line, Triple Track golf balls sell more than any other line we have. So Triple Track and Chrome Soft, Chrome Soft X and Chrome Soft XLS is the leading uh, selling golf ball. But we need to elevate the idea. So based on tour feedback and feedback from you guys, uh, we created the new one, which is the Triple Track 360, which has a Triple Track idea going all the way around the golf ball, which provides even more feedback, uh, more foundational alignment tools, and everything that you would need to play good golf. So we're gonna do this. I have a, uh, a test subject we're gonna do this on. Today, I got something, uh, someone very near and dear to my heart. It's the world of wonder. We're testing golf balls today. Here we go. Okay, so I said I had a test subject, and today I have my uncle, the man that's responsible for uh, teaching me this great game of golf, along with old bud. He's behind camera here. It's my uncle Rob. We call him Big Blue or the Big Unit. Obviously, you can see he's a big guy, but he's also a great golfer. So, Rob, you are a triple track user yes. here at Indian Ridge Country Club. Is that correct? That is correct. And how often do you play? Three or four times a week. Handicap? 4.5. And can you tell the camera how much your how how much improvement you experienced since going to Cal Callaway Bay? Uh, it's probably taken seven strokes off my handicap. Okay, we're gonna leave that there. Okay, so I want you to go through your whole routine using Triple Track, and your new uh, Odyssey putter that you have. So we're gonna hit some. This is a perfect putt. Let's use this ball here since it kicked the other one. This is a perfect putt because it obviously requires perfect alignment, right? You got to get it lined up on the line. It's kind of downhill left to right. So this is a putt that alignment is key. It's not a mindless five footer, right? Correct. Okay. So what do you use triple track for? Is it, do you use it for every putt or do you use it just Mostly for the on the like 10 footers. Okay. And then just so I make sure that I'm lined up, right? Okay, so go ahead and hit a couple of putts. I got a few balls here for you. Okay, hit another one here. There you go. So, how old, how, you're in late 60s? 70. Okay, 70 years old. So, obviously, you know, this is with all due respect, but your eyes go, I'm 46, my oh, eyes are starting to go the other way. So, definitely. alignment for you is something that you have to pay close attention to constantly, right. right? Correct. Okay. So, since my flexibility isn't as good as it used to be, so it's kind of hard to bend down all the way. Okay. I try to pick out a spot like two or three feet in front of the ball, so that way I can Somewhere line it up. Somewhere out here? Yeah, so like right out in here. Okay. And I can line it up, bending over like this, and so I don't have to get you know how to like get. in the catcher squat to <laughs> okay. line the ball up. <laughs> okay. It's important for guys my age, Johnny. Yeah. So hit one more and I'm gonna ask you a couple of questions. Okay. Okay, two good putts. This is a tough putt. So the people on camera can't really tell it's tough. It's downhill left to right. Okay, so if you could do more with triple track. Like if there was more to be done to it, what would you want in a perfect world? Like a unicorn scenario, what do you wish? I would like for the lines to go all around the ball. Okay. If there was like a little bit better of a, like an arrow or something, so okay. you could indicate exactly where you're aiming okay. would be helpful. Okay, so something that points Point, and then yeah, something that goes yeah, all the yeah. way around. Okay, so this is the triple track 360, which basically has, and I did not tee him up for this, by the way. I just gave him exactly what he wanted. That is, 360 triple track all the way around, and as you can see, that red line now has what we I would call an arrow. Triple track 360 will come in Chrome Soft X, Chrome Soft XLS, and Chrome Soft proper. So any Chrome Soft player will have a 360 option. So I want you to hit a couple putts, same putt. And this isn't about making it, it's about the feedback that you're getting. So what I want you to do is hit a couple of putts and just tell me what you're seeing that's different than OG triple track. Good putt. Same spot. So what did you see though? Anything anything like starkly different? Than... Yeah, I see the I see the the lines all the way through the putt. Okay, and you hit did you hit that out of the middle of the face? I think I did. So that would be considered like a pure roll? Yeah, pretty okay. pure. So what I've always noticed is when you draw lines all the way around, 
you know, one thing with triple track is you, you know, you can pick up the feedback with lines all the way around. And we have players on tour, John Rahm will do this from time to time, is you actually pick up total feedback, meaning if you hit a good putt, you see what a good putt looks like. Yep. If you hit a little off center, you see what that looks like, right? right. Okay, so hit one more for me. See, what I've always digged about the, the three lines is, for me, it's lining up my feet. That's why I've liked it even more so than just pointing towards the your line. Hmm. Okay, three good putts. But this wasn't about making putts. It's about the feedback that you're seeing. So three biggest takeaways today from what you learned with 360. Obviously, it's not a huge difference, but there's a difference, right? There's so, a difference for me because okay. the dispersal of my putts is a lot less. Okay. It takes out the standing over the putt and thinking, oh, my God, this goes farther left than I thought it did. Or, right. you know, when you stand over it. And if you just trust the lines and trust the perpendicular, getting your club perpendicular to the lines, and just fo I just focused on that and keeping my head down and making sure that I tried to get through the ball with a perpendicular strike rolled a lot better. See, what I've always felt, it actually gets you into the golf shot instead of thinking about technique or whatever. Like once you start focusing on alignment, you're into the shot, right? Like you're just, the focus is on just hitting it towards your target. My and focus isn't on the result, it's more on the process, correct. which is, which is what to me is, is better. I just let the outcome take care of itself. So you're going out to play this afternoon with, yeah. the, with the old guy? Correct. So I'm gonna give you a couple sleeves of these balls. Okay. And if you shoot 71, take a bunch of his money. I won't hold it against you. Okay. Uh, if you have any more questions on uh, ChromeSoft uh, 360 Triple Track across the line, go to CallawayGolf.com, World of Wonder website. That's the big unit, Uncle Rob, Johnny Wonder. Uh, we're out of here.